First, I will introduce my, uh, my uh, company where I am working, so CA, the French Agency for Atomic Energy and New Energy. It's a French public research organization. According to the last ranking of Reuters, CA was placed at the third place worldwide. We are about 16,000 uh, people. We deliver around uh, 700 patents, uh, 5,000 publications, and we have a lot of uh, partnership with uh, mainly French industry because it's part of our main mission to bridge the gap between the research and the industry and promote uh, transition. See has mainly three missions. Historically, it sees uh, the defense and the national security. The second national uh, mission is uh, energy independence of France. And the third one, which is my concern, is economic competitiveness of French industry. It is part of, the, uh, of a division called uh, CERA Tech, which is about technology research and which is split into uh, five, uh, three institutes. The LETI, which is focused on micro and nanotechnologies, mainly located in Grenoble in France. The LITEN, which is focused on new energy, uh, located in Chambéry. And uh, LIST, smart, who is working on smart digital systems, mainly located in, uh, in Paris, south of Paris. Uh, this is the place where, where I am working. The expertise area of the LIST Institute are going from uh, software and system engineering, simulation, cybersecurity, robotics, uh, man machine interface, instrumentation, and so on. And I am working mainly on software and system engineering. Before going further my presentation, I would like to advertise this will not be a presentation or a keynote on a tutorial on artificial intelligence, and fortunately for you, because I am not at all an expert on AI. I am more a user of AI in the context of software engineering. So software is eating the world. Software is everywhere. You have software in all your embedded uh, device, in your car, at home, uh, in your pocket, and so on. But AI, as I said yesterday, AI is everywhere, and we cannot make a presentation without speaking on AI. AI may eat software in, in the near future. I will explain what I mean. So there is uh, an abundant literature uh, which discusses about how AI can help software engineering. And it's not new, indeed. You can have very uh, old paper coming from 